Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be sharing what I recently got in from Amazon and Nordstrom Rack. And I recently found some really great pieces so I can't wait to share with you guys. Of course, it'll all be linked out in the description box. So a lot of these use these as either outfit inspo or you can even get a new piece or two to like create so many different winter outfit ideas. Um, so I can't wait to share and definitely comment below your favorite outfit number in the comment section. By the way, you guys, I before I start this video off, I tried hot rollers for the first time today. And I have to say, I am very impressed because I was actually looking for something to just give me like, bigger like bouncy just soft curls that like, kind of just is like flipped at the end this is after many hours of putting them in so they kind of just have fallen a little bit to like this but they were even a little bit fuller and curlier this morning but the set was from amazon i will link it below and i also posted a well and the tiktok hopefully is up by now but i am posting a tiktok on how i did it back to this outfit and um, this is the first look and outfit idea. I love doing a monochromatic look, especially for winter time. So I love pairing like the same color sweater to like jeans or bottoms, and then adding like a little bit of a different neutral up top with the outerwear. So um, this um, sweater is from Nordstrom Rack. These jeans, these are velvet that I've already had in my wardrobe, but I will include all the details to everything else in the description box and then I have on like my snow boots and then this target vest but this sweater is new in from Nordstrom Rack and I will say it's a little slightly sheer so definitely wear neutral undergarments it's a little bit like a thinner fabric but it's great for those days when it's not like super freezing and then if you just want to layer with a vest I love it for that it has a cow neck it's really cozy and soft and it does fit true to size you can see it's like a more tunic length but it has the side slit here really great price point on this and I love it styled with this vest and then my woven tote bag. And like I said, these snow boots, I think are on sale right now. They're really comfortable and they keep you, your feet like super like warm and dry. And I love these for when it's like slushy out or snow. Um, they're really practical, but they're also super cute too. Next, I got this pink tunic sweater. It's such a good length, so you could totally wear like your Spanx full leather leggings or like a tighter jean. I actually have to exchange them because they have like a little mark up top on them so i have to exchange them just because they're a little damaged but these are from ann taylor and you guys these look so similar to mother denim and they're like half the price feel like really nice quality i will say in this silhouette and style i would size up if you're in between but they look so flattering and really good on i love that little like flare at the bottom they just look so nice um, but anyways, back to the sweater is such a good price point. I believe this one is under 50 and I like the V-neck so I could wear like a necklace stack with it. And it's just a nice, easy throw on and go piece. And then just style it with like a tote bag or something. And then I have it on with my little cozy mules and then my jewelry. I have on this necklace here, my usual like hoop earrings and then my Cartier look for less bracelet. And then for a coat, I would actually just wear my J. Crew factory coat. This one, I believe they restocked it as of when I recently checked. So I would definitely check back if you've been having this on your wish list, as I know this has been sold out for quite some time. And it's such a good staple, especially for this time of year. Okay, up next, you guys, I cannot get over how darling this pearl button sweater is. Oh my gosh, it has like gold and pearl detailing here on the buttons. And it is a point tail, so I do have on this cami underneath. Um, this is just from Loft that I've had in my wardrobe, but any cami will work or like a bralette. And I think this is such a nice sweater. It's such a like nice creamy white color and it's very girly and wintry. It'll take you through quite a bit of like the winter season. I feel like all the way up until like March. So you get a lot of use out of this. And you could even wear it open on top of a dress if you wanted to, even just like a little layer if you wanted an extra like layering piece with a dress or wear it with a lace trim cami or something like that. I think it would look really great a lot of different ways. So I think it's a very versatile piece for your wardrobe. And it's also such a cute and feminine sweater. Um, I'd say true to size with this. And I have a pair of these like cream jeans. So these are a little bit different than the last I shared with you guys. They're both from Ann Taylor though, the jeans, but this is a different style. I love these too because they have like a little like white lacquered and gold button and then i also just styled it with my pink bag and my cozy mules again 
But yeah, you guys, the sweater, what do we think of it? It is, I think it's so darling. Next outfit idea is an athleisure look. So both these sneakers and this jacket are Nordstrom rack finds. I couldn't even believe I found these sneakers on the sale. So let's start off with the jacket. This is a reversible jacket. So it has the puffer side um, inside here and then it has this cozy material on the outside or I should say you could like reverse it either way. I personally bought it just for like the white cozy outer, but it's also make a really cute puffer coat. So you kind of get two coats in one. So it makes them two totally different looks. So it makes it like two totally different looks. I am wearing my regular size. I would say it fits very true to size and it's like so cozy and great for like taking a walk or going to the gym or um, running errands. It's just a nice casual outfit. And then I have on this sweater is from Amazon. This is like old in my wardrobe, but I will still link it because I think it's still available. It comes with um, a set of matching shorts, like a lounge set, but I also like wearing it for like athleisure and for like casual wear. And then I have on my new aloe yoga leggings in the espresso color. So they're a nice like deep brown. I love them. Okay, and then these sneakers are so good, you guys. I love this pink and these feel weightless. Like they literally feel like you're barely wearing anything on your feet. So I definitely recommend these. These are obviously not like a running sneaker by any means. So they're not gonna be like for, you know, major working out or anything, but they're nice for walking and just, um, like more of athleisure sneaker. So yeah, I really adore them. I love the pink. Next, we have this really pretty knotted dress. This would be perfect for work wear. You could also style this with tights. I have it on with some ballet flats that I've had in my shoe collection. I think these are great for work wear. I will see if they're still available, but I thought they went really nicely with this dress if you're looking for a like good flat shoe for work. And then I just did my smaller Tory Burch bag and this is a, such a cute flap and I like the color combo of the two. But this dress does fit true to size. The length is really great too. I'm 5'7". So if you're more petite too, it'll be, the length will even be better like for work wear. Um, but it does have an invisible zipper going along the back. Like I said, it does fit true to size and I love this color. And then the knotted detail really kind of like adds a little bit of a waist there. So it's very flattering as well. And then for jewelry, I have on my pearl initial necklace, which is always like pretty much on repeat for me. And then these pearl hoop earrings and then my usual bracelets. Next is this Amazon sweater. So I wanted to style this two different ways for you guys. So this first way is more of like a dressy casual option to ha of how to style the sweater. And then I'll show you guys a really casual look. So I just first wanna talk about the sweater itself. So this is, like I said, an Amazon find. It comes in tons of other colors as do most Amazon sweaters, I feel like. Um, and then it has a more fitted sleeve, but then it has a wider like underarm area and it is a full on tunic length. So you could totally wear this with all your fitted bottoms, especially when you like your Spanx full of other leggings. Items like that would be perfect with the sweater just to balance it out with the like loose slouchy look. Um, I love this rosy pink on their website. I will say it comes off a little bit brighter, but it's a true like rose pink. So it's really, really pretty. And it has a turtleneck detail. It's not itchy or scratchy. And it does, I would say fit overall true to size. The way I styled it this way is dressy. So I took these like more dress pants. These are like a pull on dress pant. They're really comfortable. So if you have like a very casual workwear dress code, this would be an amazing outfit to wear, especially for winter. Um, I just styled it with some mules and these are Amazon. They're like so good, very comfortable. And I love this like neutral color because I have a pair of like, like a, a cream white color and I love those so much. But then if I want to wear something like a different tone, more nude, I go for these and they do fit true to size. And these have been some of the top sellers of last year from Amazon from you guys. And then I just did like a dressier handbag and then my pearl earrings. But I'm gonna show you guys another way to style the sweater, just a little bit more casual. Okay, the sun finally decided to come out today. <laughs> so I have like, trying to get out of the sun here for you guys. You can see the outfit in full. So I styled the same exact sweater, just a little bit more casual, but still girly elements to it. So what do we think? Would you guys wear it the first way, more dressy? Do you see yourself styling the sweater the dressier way or the more casual way? 
I'm kind of like leaning towards the casual way. I think this is really cute. I have it on with these blue jeans from Ann Taylor. These are really great silhouettes. They're good like mid-range price point compared to some of like the designer options I've seen. And then it's also like a level up from some others that I've shared. So I think the quality is insanely good on these. The fit is really nice and um, they do fit true to size. And I have it set with my cozy mules. And then for a bag, I just, because I was going for a casual look, I went with my just slouchy, very casual tote bag. And then I just added, of course, had to add a girly element with the pearl headband and yeah this sweater though looks so cute either way you style it and it's great you could wear it both ways and get tons of use out of it from casual weekend style from like a saturday morning just like running errands or something and then just wear it during the week for work so i feel like it's a great versatile sweater all right up next is this really pretty and casual outfit idea but it's like casual chic vibes so i have on this sweater which is amazon and also this coat again which is amazon both are amazing capsule wardrobe pieces for 2023 i think these are amazing to have and you could have them when it right now and then when it comes back for like um even actually the springtime this coat again would be great and then again in the fall and winter um this year let's talk about this coat again first and i'll take it off and show you guys the sweater this uh, has side pocket details. It's really soft and cozy, very nicely made. It's in this neutral color, but there it may be in my eyes, maybe there's a little bit of wash to it, but not much. Um, but it is to me like a nice soft neutral color. So it goes and blends beautifully with a lot of pieces in my wardrobe, which is why I really like it. This is reminiscent kind of of the Ann Taylor coat again, which I have. That one is a little bit more pink toned, but if you're looking for something neutral, this is a nice option. And then I have all my white velvet jeans and these booties and my pearl tote bag. And then I'm going to show you guys this sweater. And here's what the sweater looks like. I have it tucked in but it has a mock neck detail. It's really soft and it actually looks like something you would see at like J. Crew. This comes in quite a few other color options and the length is really good. I'd say it's a medium length, perfect for workwear, just like super chic, casual vibes too. Um, you could dress this up with your favorite workwear pants if you wanted to wear it more like workwear friendly other than like the velvet jeans that I have on. And then um, I'd say this sweater though, does fit pretty true to size. It's not super fitted, um, but it is more like slimmer fit. Okay, I am very excited about this next jacket because this is one of the first things that I added to my cart. And it's quilted on this outside and it has this like cozy lining on the inside. And you guys, it is so warm and cozy. I really love the silhouette and the color is absolutely stunning. And it does have the quilted detailing and the price on this is like over 50% off from the original. I just wanna show you guys a little behind the scenes of some things that don't always make it. Um, when I get a Tron haul in a lot of pieces, there are some pieces and sometimes there's just one or two that don't work out or sometimes there's a bunch that don't work out for me. Sometimes it's like the quality or sometimes it's the coloring that wasn't what I personally expected. This is an example of something that to me like looks totally different in person than on the website. Um, usually Nordstrom Rack does a really good job of like being pretty accurate with coloring, but this just to me was really off. Um, so I am going to be returning this and this did not make the try and haul. Um, there was like two other pieces. There's two other pieces that I didn't include just because I didn't absolutely love them and you guys know I always want to only share what I absolutely love and would like recommend to like my own friends and family but yeah um this is a cute vest though it's just that the coloring wasn't what I expected it to be but if you are looking for like a more like purpley colored vest I will include the link because there's like nothing wrong like quality wise with it but um I mean it feels like really nice um and well it looks really well made but just the coloring was off. All right, so that is it for today's Nordstrom Rack and Amazon try and haul. If you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed these types of stores, definitely give this video a thumbs up and let me know if you have any requests for any new videos in the new year that you guys wanna see here on my channel. I would love to hear what you guys wanna see next. All right, and I'm gonna end today's video here. I love you all so, so much, and I will see you all in my next video very soon. Bye.